we're quite keen to support mindfulness and well-being uh, as much as we can do because people well-being is of key importance in our school. We have nurture, we use a uh, place to be to support our people well-being and I felt mindfulness would add a whole other level of support for our, our children and families. Something interesting about mindfulness is sometimes if you if you're like oh I can't do this me and um, you try it and you still think it's a little bit scary you could just take a second to breathe and you'll feel a whole lot better. We support them as they become adults. I find myself if I had a, a busy or a stressful day at work I will quite often go home and find myself you know, my brain jumping and, yeah. and I'll be checking work emails on my phone. Yeah. Really, you shouldn't be doing that. And hopefully Absolutely. if kids can start to learn these practices earlier on, then they'll yeah. actually be mentally healthier by the time they reach, you know, my age, adulthood and, and start working and be able to actually separate yeah. life from work. Yeah. I would definitely see it as a real positive impact, especially if we keep stopping and thinking about it and actively using it. I noticed that I'm more calm and I'm more, like, more enthusiastic. That's the same thing what happens to me. Like, I'm better, like, at maths and stuff like that because, like, same. I concentrate and stuff like that.